This is my 2011 Harley Davidson Sportster. And I want to show you what a pain in the ass it is to take out the battery. Because you got to reach in to the back there to the negative terminal with a 10 millimeter wrench and wiggle that screw out. And the reason is because the negative battery cable is too short. Um, and the thing is, if this was an AGM battery, it would be even tighter and heavier. So what I did is I swapped it out with a lithium battery from WPS, uh, Firepower featherweight battery with a battery capacity indicator, which tells you whether or not the battery is fully charged or half, half charged. So if you see when you press this button, you'll see that blue light. That means it's nearly dead. But what it does is it shuts off um, the battery cells so that it doesn't drain completely and uh, kill the battery because then it, it might be a, uh, uh, difficult to revive it. But so long as you use a, um, a lithium uh, you know, trickle charge, it should revive the battery. These things are very resilient. Um, the other thing is uh, you want to remove the main fuse, which is a... 30 amp fuse first before you you do that and another thing I do is I put a uh, some electrical tape on on the handle of the, of the 10 millimeter wrench so that it doesn't hit any metal parts of the frame so it doesn't spark or short out anything but yeah I've done this so many times especially in the winter that it's it's become second nature um, but just so that you guys know this is what you need to do. All right, take care, bye. Hope this helps somebody.